DJI is really excited to be participating in the first annual AUVSI Humanitarian Excellence Awards. Drone innovation is not being driven by the technology itself, but by you, the users. We have North America, South America, Africa, Europe, Asia, all represented in the five awards at today's conference. And all of the use cases are different. So you have people creating a volunteer network across Chile. You have a large professional team scanning the wreckage after a natural disaster in North America. So what we've seen is, is technology in the hands of people who are in a position to put it to good use can be not just beneficial economically and artistically, but also life-saving. Before Zibline, the Rwanda government utilized bike and trucks or cars to deliver these life-saving blood. Because of the rough terrains and the road condition, the delivery time could be very, very long. But with the drone delivery service, we are able to cut down that time from hours to 10 to 15 minutes. So drones and satellite communication combined help you quicker get an accurate overview of the situation so you can faster respond and get the right help in there. In the past, you had to have big laptops and computers where you run the software. Now we can run everything we're doing in a smartphone using the DJI SDK to bring along one kilo satellite terminal, your drone, and the smartphone, and you're good to go anywhere in the world. What DJI platforms can do is uh, save time, it's all about time, to help people, you know, that those extra few seconds you get uh, using drones uh, will help save people every year. Of course it's going to be make a huge difference to first responders and helping people. Eh, bueno, eh, en Chile es un país hermoso, desde Arica hasta Punta Arenas. Tenemos diferentes climas, pero también tenemos que convivir con diferentes tipos de desastres. Eh, y ahí es donde nosotros nos introdujimos en el mundo de los drones Entendíamos que esa tecnología hace un par de años iba a permitirnos buscar personas, ayudar a levantar información. Drones have an absolutely incredible opportunity to contribute to life-saving missions all around the world. This is not only the technology, but this is also doing unmanned for good. So I mean, there is a good humanitarian reasons why do we use drones and robotics nowadays. I think what we've seen at this show and others is a huge move from systems that were primarily limited to large enterprise corporations or to military operators. And with the advent of affordable small quadcopters, uh, you now have technology in the hands of innovators, entrepreneurs, artists, people doing public safety applications, firefighters, volunteers, and that's where we see a tremendous ramp up in the benefits to all kinds of industries and uh, different applications. For many people, um, unmanned systems and drones have really only come into public consciousness, if you will, probably over the f last five to ten years. So that's why, again, this awards program was so important to us because it not only highlights uh, the innovation in, in this industry and the technology advancements, but again, how people are applying this technology um, to do a wide variety of really great things um, that impact a lot of people around the world. As more people get their hands on the technology, they start understanding the bigger potential of what it can do. And we've seen amateur photographers and filmmakers, professional roof inspectors, start realizing that a drone in a crisis helps reduce the time and risk in saving lives. And that's really the story that all of the different participants in this awards are able to tell.